Taking a live look from our DOT camera, a reminder for all drivers, police can now pull you over if they see you with a phone in your hand in a school or construction zone. That new law took effect today. News for Jack's reporter Ashley Spicer is live now in our mobile newsroom in Nassau County. That's where she rode along with the sheriffs. And Ashley, how did it go? It went well today. People definitely got their warnings. Most of our ride along happened along State Road 200 here in Nassau County. I'll show you what it looks like. A very active construction zone, cones everywhere, uh, lining 200 on both sides. And a lot of people we spoke to that I noticed the biggest deal was they weren't quite sure what hands-free meant. They were kind of confused. They felt like if they weren't texting, they weren't breaking the law. Well, they learned today that no matter what you're doing, if it's in your hands, it is against the law. Nassau County Deputy Dallas Palachuk says this new law is making it much easier to cite people for distracted driving because now, like this driver we saw, all an officer has to do is see the phone in your hand. They don't have to prove what you were doing on it. Do you know why I'm stopping no. you? You were on your cell phone in this construction zone. Did you realize that's against the law? No. Yes, ma'am. Were you texting? I'm sorry. Woo. Were you texting on the phone? No, no, no. Sorry. Okay. Well, you had it up for a good ways because we were up beside you. Really? No, yes, ma'am. No, I wasn't texting. Law enforcement officers are just handing out warnings now through December 31st, but after that, you will get a ticket with a fine. Starting January 1st, the fine will be $60 and three points on your driver's license. Since July 1st, FHP issued 463 warnings for texting and driving. Police statewide have written 605 tickets. Riding with Nassau County in just one hour, Absolutely. we warned three people who all claim they were unaware of this new law. She again said that she wasn't aware of the law and that she wasn't actually talking on the phone, that the person in the car next to her was making her feel uncomfortable while she was driving, so she picked the phone up. So That's kind of strange. Uh, we'll see all kinds of uh, excuses, uh, excuses come up <laughs> why they have their phone. Now, the same lawmaker who helped push the texting and driving law wants to go a step further. Just yesterday, a bill was filed, and if it's passed, Florida would be entirely hands-free uh, if it is signed off on. Now, Georgia passed a similar law last year, and again, this is through construction zones and school zones that we're talking about. Do not even have the phone in your hand. It doesn't matter what you're doing. You will get a citation. I'm live in Nassau County, Ashley Spicer, Channel 4, The Local Station.